are now tuned in to Game Time Sports. We got to get Kondo right here next to us. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's what it is, man. man. Listen, man. This record is filthy, man. This dude with them been in the game at least 15, 20 plus. Lyricists. The, the, the majority of no, the stuff. Y'all talking hearing. about MF Dude. Yeah, with the yeah. MF Dude. No, ass. yeah, I know him. The, I'm talking about the other guy. NF. Who is it? NF. <laughs> the, the, I, forgive me for saying this. The, the white boy. Yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. Good. They're talking about some MF Dude and NF are two different people. Oh, okay, yeah. I'll talk about the one that's recent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The crazy part about this NF guy is the white dude. Yeah, yeah. So, so like, <laughs> okay. I love white people too. I do. I do. I do. All right. No, but the crazy thing about NF. So, so I, okay. You ask me who the greatest white rapper is. I'm going to say Eminem. Eminem, yeah. obviously. But if you ask this young, if you ask this, the little kids nowadays, yeah. they don't know who Eminem is. They're going to tell you oh, NF. God. I mean, I grew up with Eminem I, still. I, I, I mean, I, I like Collins. I grew up with Eminem too, you know? No, I'm I mean, listening to younger. Music. I'm talking about my, talking about my, my nieces, my nieces and my nephews, my seven, eight, nine-year-old nephews and nieces. You, we, we, that's just how it goes. It's a cycle. It's a cycle. Like you guys said, it's a cycle. You know what I mean? Night, which brings us to night. Who are your, tra- your top three? Man, right now, Mo3, King Von, and then what's my, uh, my, my white boy from the Bay? G- yeah, G. <laughs> yeah, that, 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 that boy got bars. Hey, I'm sorry. Hey. You know what I'm saying? Front to back, seat, that boy got bars. And okay. I, I've, I've seen his progression from, from the first CD. You know what I'm saying? These things happen until now. Yeah. Boy, get, get him another year or two. So is the question who are the three hottest or who are the three favorite? Uh, favorite. Just no, like recently, the three top right now, not like from the past, oh. just like within the past five years. <clears throat> we're not talking about legends. We're just talking about like the like Gen Z and yeah. millennials, yeah. I guess. Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> no, because because yeah. I can't. Uh, we talk. I, even though E forty, I had to say it. no. But we'll, back to what we're talking about. I'm, I'm a huge fan right now of of the baby. Okay. Yeah. And what really impressed me about the baby is he, he, he all his songs weren't. Strictly auto tune. Okay. He was a young cat coming in with bars. Yeah, that guy bars. A, a whole it's different style right? for right? It's, it's his production. Yeah, his production. production? Yeah. Wow. Even even when he comes in on a yeah, beat, he don't wait. The way he, the way he, he drives the track is some crazy. And and, I, and great. I gotta say, uh, his delivery. Even yeah. little baby, little baby. I think he's killing it right now. Yeah. He's he, killing he, it. He's he been killing it since he since he came out, bro. And not to mention, he came in with Brick. I can't do three, man. You got, you got okay, because it's, 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 hey, I, I, uh, yeah, I'm a Megan Thee Stallion fan, bro. Ah, <laughs> she, not only is she big no, sexy, she's, bro, she got bars. <laughs> bro, she rap better than a lot of dudes. Megan Thee Stallion, disrespect. Megan Thee Stallion, I love you, baby, bro. But you disrespectful as hell. What? <laughs> what? No, she, she's dope. She's dope. <laughs> You know, Did so I just really put her in the bottom of your bottom? What about Juice What about X? No, but, but we're talking about right. No, I'm a fan of, of X. I, re- I wasn't at first. Three. I had to take a time out and a break from music to really go back and listen yeah. to what this younger generation yeah. is listening to. Yeah. And, and, and actually, I think Juice World and X are probably the most artistic. Yeah. The most artistic in their style, their persona, yeah. their art. Yeah, they're walking art. Mm-hmm. Hey, I, I'll get X in. That dude with something else. He is. Even when you hear, like, you can play 10 artists and it would all sound the same. Yeah. But X, no. you know who that is. Yeah, you know yeah. who that is. Too, yeah. emotional, too emotional for me. Too emotional? But you know what, though, Carlo? That, that, that's, that's on that note? That's the I, substance, I, man. That's, that's what... Because young- all these little niggas is depressed. Yes. <laughs> oh, <God>. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but do y'all know why though? No. I, I'm, I think no. this is funny. We're talking about this. I think technology and social media has to do a lot of that because they're kind of the people brought up in that social media, it's right? Listen, Down syndrome, maybe. But, it's, it's, but it's, also, it's also the drugs. All these pills, all Man. these pills is now the wave. Like when me and I grew up, it was just weed. weed. Just weed. You know what I'm saying? Then you had your people that 
participated in the harder drugs. Yeah, 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 yeah. But nowadays, the younger kids, the epidemic is it's automatic. Pills. Automatic. Yeah, yeah, it's, I, I, it's still I, weed. Uh, it's still weed. Basically, most yeah, of all. It's also about flexing, too. It's about all flexing. Things. I'm the baddest, you know, like I have this, I have that, you know what I'm saying? Oh, oh man. Flexing, that's you know, that's like, what I'm saying. Damn, that's flexing. Yeah, that's they the man was doing all the stuff, though. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's why they flexing. You know, a smart musician is not about to be flexing and put itself out there like that. Yeah. That's not smart. Well, it depends. I think it depends. Wait, 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 wait. If you if you know what you're doing in your like, okay, I'm a, I'm a, I, I I don't even want to bring this name. Up. <laughs> bring it up. Uh, six nine. Yeah. I know. I know. <laughs> Check this out. No, no. I, I don't condone what he did. I don't cope. No, I don't. No, I, somebody plays this music. I hey, bro, change that. I'm just I don't. I, no, yeah, I don't. Okay, okay, okay. But on that note. This he was very smart because he knew how to stir the pot and get people talking about it, right? So if he's an artist and you're in the business of entertainment and you have to draw controversy and get people yeah, talking yeah. about you, but from artists, he knew how to do it. From yeah. artists, he knew artists, how to do it. Do you respect him as an artist? Who? Or, uh, six nine. As an artist, yes. As an artist, a, as a yes. Person, I, as I don't person. know the out of out of the whole out of the whole. I, that's, that's I respect situation. him as an artist. I can't say a person because, no. like, like I said, we're old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we're from the old yeah. school. Okay. We're yeah. talking. You, know you don't right. rap, right? You, you don't snitch. Yeah. Yeah. You know what happens? But here's the thing: his ex- I, there was people co-signing, giving him a pass for snitching. Here's the thing: you wanted to be gangster, hollering this and this, toting guns. Yeah. You signed up for that. Okay. All that mm-hmm. stuff you talk about, you signed up for. It comes with people this trying to rob you, yeah. trying to sleep with right. your girl. So you can't it take so, so, all the. So is that like the new curve now? Like I don't know. The cool thing. I don't know. Wow. He made, he made it something. cool for some. I was, I'm still from way back. That's crazy. I don't believe it, and I never would. That's crazy. That seems like one of the first people. Yeah. yeah, I was. You you take you don't say nothing. Yeah. If you, you gotta get beat up, even if you even if you getting yeah. ratted on, yeah, you don't rat. Right. You know right. what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. That's yeah. just yeah. period. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And for for people to even be accepting it now. I'm still not getting it. It's like a big slap in the face to me because yeah. I still don't get it. I won't get it. Yeah. The dude shouldn't even be making money no more. You know what I'm saying? Or let alone be in the game for that, being on a, a front, you know what I'm saying? So front street type My thing, the thing the way I said the reason I said I respect him as an artist because one of the things that put him over the edge is, is dude recorded his own music. Yeah. Dude shot his own videos, wow. did everything himself. Wow. So yeah, like, and the, the first couple of tracks was group. You know what I'm saying? They, they went, but until you, oh, I, 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 I got a confession. I was lightweight jealous when he was flexing on the gram with Nicki Minaj. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> and then like, yeah, I was like, wow. Hey. Yeah, yeah. Well, anyways, <laughs> yeah. anyways, next time. This music baby. get deep, baby. It do. Oh, Speaking yeah. of get deep with the music, uh. The weekend is boycotting the Grammys because he got zero nominations. Here's the funny thing. How does the artist perform at the halftime Super Bowl but won't even get a nomination for a Grammy? Well, what? See, that's what I mean, bro. Hey, but 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 I'm glad I'm glad we're talking about this. Since we're on the subject of music, I got a producer. We got Crondo do music, and I know there's gonna be people that watch and do music. This is something I learned personally. So I used to think you just Put out great music and people nominate you. Right. That's not how the Grammys right. work. Sounds good. How, how, no, no, close. But this is how the the Grammys work. From the research I, I did. So if anybody want to know the truth, go go look it up, research for yourself, and don't always take my word for it. But from what I researched, so the way the Grammys work is, you have to register as a voter. Yes. So let's say we're at a table. We're all musicians. No. We have to register as a voter, and and vote. New best artist, best solo. We have to vote. Once we submit our vote, that qualifies <laughs> us to be nominated. Oh, so they got their yes. own little it's election going down, right? The cycle. It's a system. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yes. That's wow. from the research yeah. I did. That's that's how you get nominated for Grammys. You have to become a voter, vote for somebody, then you put out your own music, then you can fall in the nomination. Yeah, that's party. great. Yeah. So that's look it up, great. putting y'all people on game, man. For and it's sure on the podcast. Is. That's how we do it. But hey, we're going to take a quick break. Word from our sponsors. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. Hey. 
Hey, we're back, everybody. Hey, once again, special thanks to all our sponsors out there. Be sure to check them up if you guys need any of them services. By all means, feel free to get in contact with them, and they'll take good care of you. Okay, yes, Carlos. Sir. Here we go. We're going into news right now. Uh, we have the Nets signing former All-Star Blake Griffin right now. Wow. Which is insane, dude. There is Kyrie Irving, you have James Harden, Kevin Durant. Insane. He, That's an All-Star yeah, team, bro. He's that washed. Basically, he's, he's all, washed. He, he, he is, is but, he's but, washed. but all, all he needs to be is a three or a role player. Here, quick facts. He appeared in 642 games as a starter with 21.4 points per game. That guy's right. insane. You know what I'm saying? You still got to so, go up on the board. So. We, we know Boston's going to be in the Eastern Finals. We oh, know, uh, or not Finals, but in the playoffs. They might yeah. go to the Finals. Boston, yeah. Philly. Yeah. Does Brooklyn, does, does Brooklyn, this move yeah. solidify yes. Brooklyn yes. as a, a they Eastern? They did solidify it already. They didn't need Blake Griffin to be already there. I, I think they did. No, I, I think they even, did. Even though he was a good addition, the, to West, the, the West is he tough wasn't. right now. Yeah, the aren't, aren't the, the top tough. teams in the West? Yeah, yeah, they, they Utah, are. Utah, yeah. Suns, Lakers. They, yep. they are, right? Yeah, right. Yeah, it, it takes the team, not just that one person. You uh, I mean? Yeah, yeah. You put that one person on the get there. He, he's done. You know what I'm saying? So you, you got to have that unison in order to you get. You got to have good chemistry. Right? Yeah. But Kyrie, KD, of late. Oh, my goodness, bro. Hey, how long man, has Blake been in the NBA for? A minute. Yeah, wow. It's a cold yeah. squad for sure. I think his peak was when he was with the Clippers. <laughs> when he played with the Clippers, I thought they <laughs> were phenomenal. He's up CP3. And, and, yeah, uh, he, he, he was in his own mistake. Yeah, they, they became so. relevant. Yeah, they right. weren't the and Clippers of the old. Yeah. yeah. So, I don't know. The next but stop, speaking of news, and then we got uh, LeBron James. Uh, no surprise, you can't keep him out of the headlines. He's leading in NBA merchandise with the first half of the NBA season. There you go. And then, quick facts right here: Kevin Durant is number three in merchandise sales. Kyrie Irving number six, and James Harden number nine. That Sweet. means you got three wow. Brooklyn Net players in top ten merchandise Ooh, sales. That is insane. Hey. That's why you're my agent. <laughs> <laughs> my lawyer and my agent. Facts. I'm your agent and you're my agent. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my lawyer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're so my lawyer. I'm a double edged sword. Well, isn't that insane? You got three uh, Brooklyn Net players in top 10 in sales. That's Merchandise crazy, sales. Man. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. Damn. That's beautiful. You man. think that's by design or? or just, all things, it might be. No, nah, I don't think that's, I think that's like, calculated. No, I don't think it's just coincidence. You got three players in the top 10. No, no, they had to figure that out. Yeah, yeah, well, that's sure. what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, I can yeah, see that. I can yeah. see that. Yeah, for sure. You know what, what was mean? that? Was that Jay Z again? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, Chop, do you have any other news right now? Uh, since we're on the topic of merchandise and NBA, uh, NBA Top Shot is uh, one of the newest uh, trends in the NBA. For those who don't know what that is, it's digital art. It's becoming the next big wave of rather, you know how our era, we're old, of course, right? <laughs> right? Of course. We had trading cards. Right, 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 right. The new thing yeah. is this digital art. NFT, so, it's called NFT. NFT. Okay. So there was a man who purchased the first NBA digital art for, I think, $175,000. That's crazy. That sounds crazy, don't that it? That is crazy. Right? But you know what's even crazier? What's we're talking crazy? about this had to been like a month ago. Yes. That art he purchased is now worth twenty million. Wow! Uh, yeah, yeah. Make make, make your your art work for you, baby. You know, yeah. how, how does that worth twenty million, bro? I can't even oh, get you, ten you, likes on Facebook, bro. You, you, <laughs> <laughs> what is going on, bro? I can't, come on, man. Hey, it's, it's, it's a secret society in the art, man. Yeah, so it's on stage. Yeah. It's on politics. I, I, that that's it's always going to be. It's always going to be some yeah. kind of political get yeah. down in the background. But unless you're in the politics or part of the crowd that's listening to the politics, you know what I'm saying? You're not sure. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know, so that, that, that's where you got to find that back door until, you know what I'm saying, their little secret society, because not everybody know about it. Just so that, do you, you think know. secret societies are real? For sure. Yes. Yeah. I don't yes. know. Yes. For sure. Like, I yes. think it's I fun to watch right. the YouTube videos. But like, I don't really know. No, nah, you, 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 you. I don't know. You, I mean, pick, I you pick a part. Mm -hmm. You pick a part because you, you, you know truth for truth. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and you know, that's the white man. <laughs> you, you know what I'm saying? That's just real. Uh, do you think uh, secret, societies secret societies are real? Well, yeah. Yeah. Like, okay. Hey, you heard it. Like, what's it? Look, hey, I'm gonna get away with this. He's not gonna come up missing. 
There's still like things of like the KKK is still like a thing mm. today. Yeah, so like, yeah. Oh, so yeah. yeah, hey, that's a good, that's a good. It's, it's yeah. an actual fact. I've lived in Birmingham, Alabama, and it's still popular. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah, even yeah. today, it's still going there. You might have something that's sort of secretive about it, but for the most part, if a motherfucker don't like you, they're going to let you know. Mm. Well, like, yeah, on God. Like anonymous, too, yeah. if you know who that is. He's, yes, sti- he's still a thing. Yes. So. See, I, I, I was starting to think maybe anonymous was like the feds. <laughs> right. They're just putting content out to see who the biggest people are who, who would agree or be part of a movement with them. It'd be great the, fishing bait. Suppliers, man. I don't know, like I said. But then again, is it clickbait? Is it content? Is it just to get views? Like, I, I have no clue. Some, some, but then again, it's all made to give you the, the content depending on what you search. You know what I'm saying? Because you can be on the internet tonight, get on it tomorrow, and the same thing you was thinking about last night well, pop up. It's happened to me plenty of times. I'm going to tell a quick story. Else. I'm gonna tell, since we're on the topic of secret, secret societies, right? So one night, I'm on YouTube. Hey, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I must have been 10 it's, hours it's, deep into Illuminati videos. <laughs> wow. hey, here, here we go. Look. So this video pops up. Uh-huh. It's like a dark room, and and this man comes out talking about, oh, you want to be part of this? See? You don't come seek us. We find you, right? Hey, I could not make this up, bro. This was all on, uh, uh, right? Get this. Hey, hey, Freddy Krueger. So I'm like, oh, okay, bro. <laughs> we're going we're gonna to talk about it. Uh, just say, uh, on another show. Continue, 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 but this continue. video, so I'm tripping out. I'm like, what? Is this real? So I go back, okay, let me rewatch it. I go to rewatch it, it's not there. Uh-huh. I hit refresh. <laughs> it's not there. Bro, I can't make this up, bro. Yeah, right. I just it's thought it was the shit. perfect thing to bring in since we on that topic hey, anyway. It, it happens, dog. I'm, I'm gonna keep it at one. You can't be that high and that drunk. Bro, I'm so, so running I was, back. <laughs> I was so bro. That's the best He just ran back. He didn't <laughs> skip. He didn't fumble or none of that. You know what I'm saying? He just ran it back. The, the creepy man coming out the shadows and stuff. You know? <laughs> man. I can believe it, bro. I've read books on this type of stuff. Yeah, you mean. can't make this stuff up, bro. Yes. Whether, whether it's in hip hop, whether it's in real life. You know what I'm saying? Dude, Them boy. six families are true, people. But you know what I did? I seen a documentary on TV. So get this. Since we're on this topic, why not? Hey. So here was here was a topic. We about to so go check this out. <laughs> so so this is the Masons were we about to go global, man. Hey, <laughs> hey, 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 hey we we're about hey, to get hey, a knock at the door. door. Hey, hey. So the Masons were American. People yeah. that, that when they when you see the the what is uh-huh. it, the, the symbol? You got the, the M, you got it's the supposed G, to be you know. for the, the workers, the workers who built the foundation, right? The Illuminati was the the from Europe. Mm-hmm. They infiltrated the Masons and somehow mixed. That, that, I don't know. That, that, that was on a documentary. That, that relates I seen. to the Moors and all this type of stuff. But, but we're getting a little bit too deep. But see, the, but my, thing is, <laughs> yeah, my yeah. thing is, I don't like talking about things I don't know about. No, I'm ready, I'm ready to yeah. So I'll like dip and dabble touch, but I don't speak my behalf. So on do things you think I don't know. secret societies exist? Do I? It's either yes or no. The only secret, <laughs> bro, I'm gonna be honest. The only secret societies I think that truly exist uh, in today's world are are the people with, and I don't even call so them. It's a yes shit. then. No, uh, you just people with yes. money. Yes. I'm not wrong. So I mean, it's a yes. No, not the like have and I have not. Not, not like so. No. Yes, there you go. The have and the I have, have not. Nots. I'm not saying the people with money are parts of secret societies. I'm just saying they. It's it's like a. Because people with money don't tell you they got money. No. They don't show it. Smart, good day. You can be passing by one every day, talking to one every day at work, and not even knowing you got billions. We got millions. Yeah. Billions. Yeah. Yes. People. Yeah. Billions. A million, gajillion, for billion. Speaking Knowledge. of million and gajillions, <laughs> Roblox. <laughs> they're what they're estimating is that still forty-five million? No, think, right? They're the, a video game is hitting yeah. the stock market. Yeah, they finally hit the stock market. That's where they were like, there's so much, billions and billions. It's crazy. Yeah, 
I, I played the games. It's pretty cool. I know. I seen. I seen. I played when I was like five. <laughs> my little nephew's no, 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 playing. The age is like it's like it's younger kids, right? But it's also like expanding to seventeen to twenty four too. It's rapidly like growing too. I think yeah. that's weird. For yeah. Yeah. That's weird. <laughs> you think it's what? It's weird. I think it's, it's weird for grown ass motherfuckers to be playing Roblox <laughs> <laughs> or, or talking about it. <laughs> <laughs> It might be weird, bro, but they, the, hey, they're making millions and billions, bro. They're making they, money they, off of they it. They're are, making bro. a big, huge profit they off are. of it. So, you know what I'm saying? I mean, if, if, you, if you can make that much money off of what, what's the other one everybody was playing? That's why I said Carlos. Fortnite. Yeah. Ooh. You know what I'm saying? Well, that, was that, was huge, that was a huge, huge. game. That blew up out of nowhere. I still don't get that game. Even Minecraft. <laughs> Minecraft. No, Minecraft is Minecraft was like the low no. bar. I think Minecraft is still it's up there. I think. Yeah, it's still one of the biggest. I think Minecraft is real, bro. What? That's the only thing. I think that's how the pyramids were built. <laughs> what? We're talking it's about we're we getting into the ET chromosome. Hey, you're getting too deep into this now. We're just talking about a video game. Like, come on, what's what's the deep end of the pool? Hey, we're talking about video games. Hey, this is one gonna be. Oh yeah, uh, oh okay. god, our most viewed episode. <laughs> <laughs> the, well, I'm so hey, well that wraps it up. Well, we gotta talk about the gaming real quick right now. The gaming, yes. All right, let's go. So uh, every Wednesday we're doing a stream, right? Uh, okay. On our channel called Carlos Castillo, we do uh, GTA Five, we do Call of Duty, we do anything, any sports game, everything we can do right there. Yeah, and uh, I just want to put that monster. plug in right now. But yeah, make sure you guys. Uh, Go into our YouTube channel because we'll be streaming every Wednesday. So I just want to point that out. Hey, by the way, man. What is it again? It's uh, Carlos Castillo. That's our channel name right Castillo. now. Castillo. No, Castillo. <laughs> Carlos has his uh, YouTube channel, and then we have the Game Time Sports YouTube channel. Would you like to? So hit subscribe on both. Would you like to tell your channel? It's no, that's the, what do you mean? Game no, that, like, the Game Time Sports. <laughs> I keep it all whatever Game Time Sports so that, content. Yeah, game Time Sports. That's yeah. the other channel as well. But Carlos, Carlos's channel is, is kicking my butt right now. We're all, <laughs> he's we're got all, he's got mad content. We're all in this together, bro. Yeah. Well, are we? It's just like, hey, he, hello, team <laughs> player. Hey, he says we're in this together, but this dude got like thirty videos on his channel. I got like two. <laughs> <laughs> Are you in the video? About your showmanship. I don't right? know. Am, am I? You got better start taking the GoPro with you everywhere. I know you be seeing some crazy stuff out there. Check it out, dude. Hey, the channel is. Start doing fun. vlogs. Hey, <laughs> hell no. I'm not going to vlog, man. Yo, what's up, guys? I'm just here. No, I'm not sure. You said, how are you doing? <laughs> yeah, you know, hey, I'm back from the secret underground, you know what I'm saying, secret society, you know, make sure you guys subscribe. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, okay. They're going to be asking for this guy, huh, bro? I'm They're a lawyer. Where's the lawyer? <laughs> <laughs> nah, man. Oh, man, shit, nah. that's ill. Hell yeah. Any shout outs? Let's get some shout outs, man. Right, oh, man. Shout out to everybody. Shout out to the whole team. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> shout out to the whole PHX. Shout out to my city. Shout out to everybody's city. You dig that? Colin. Uh, I don't know. Hey, shout out to Colin and Knight for joining us. Colin, shout out to Colin and Knight for joining us. I love the public too. Love to sometimes. Let me get my shout I'll let you do the closing shout outs. Okay. I want to give a you shot, man. I can't thank this man enough. I know this man solid A1 since day one. Indeed. Shout out to Crondo. Indeed. Shout out to Central Station Studios. Say that. Shout out to our Black Fathers Committee for everything that they doing. Dang, dang. Everything they doing. They doing some amazing, amazing things. Like, it's crazy. Yes, it's amazing. Yes. I want to give a huge shout out to AZ Compass, Ty Ty Washington for being named MVP of, of the grind session. We yeah. talked about him. Uh, the big controversy was this dude is one of the best basketball players in the country. Oh. And, and didn't, uh, first, the first controversy was he didn't get selected for the McDonald's All American. Really? Yeah. Uh, Ty, uh, Ty, Ty Washington. From, from, from AZ? AZ Compass. Bro, AZ got some ballers out here, bro. I promise you. The, the prep circuit, I'll put you on the prep circuit. What teams will follow? They got some of the best ballers, bro. They be going to New York, Minnesota, Cali, hooping them up, hooping them up. Yeah. But uh, 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 what else? Shout outs to shout outs to my man Ben Cole, BC. Shout out to yeah, BC. Shout out to Mike. Uh, who else? That's it right now. Shout, shout out to moms. Me. Shout out to the family. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hey, hey, no, but shout out to everybody out there grinding, man. Everybody out there grinding. Here's yeah. a funny part. Okay. 
We started this in a pandemic. Yeah. Right? Yeah, we did. So, what, so what's go? you're going to all people, <laughs> you're always going to have naysayers, people putting you down, but you need that. You need to use that as well, fuel. I feel, I, I feel if they're not talking about you the wrong way, you ain't doing something the right way. Love your shout outs. Yeah, I'm going to keep it simple. Uh, just shout out to Colin and Knight for joining us as our guests right now. Our goal Good. for this podcast, we want to invite athletes, artists, anybody right here to join us weekly right now. And that's the whole goal right now. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, anything you want to add? Yeah, anything you guys want to add before we close this out? Right artists, if any artists want to um, be part of the show, hit us up, man. Hit us yeah, up. For sure. Or hit Carlos up. Let's tap in. Or you know, I, I, wanted, I can't wait to bring in some some ball players. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. what people don't understand Athletes, anything, is, you know, is gamers anything. We're, doing some, we're doing something big, yeah. but we're just the small guys doing, you know what I mean, something yeah. big. We don't have the, 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 the funds like... We're yes, making it work. Know, we're making it happen, though. We're making it happen. Yeah, you know, it's going to lead us somewhere. Man. Yes, sir. It ain't, it ain't about the, the output right now. It's about what we're putting in. We're putting good vibes into the world, bro. You yes, know sir. What I'm I, thank God for this. They don't yeah, I thank God for making this all this happen, bro. Hey, yeah. yes, sir. That, that, that's first and foremost, man. You got to thank the man, man. Because you woke up being able to do this and you're going to go to sleep with more ideas to come, man. Yeah. For and, sure. and then this was his plan. Not ours. Indeed. Right? Say that. Amazing. Amazing. Hey, Colin, you want to add anything before we close this out? I ain't got nothing. All right, man. This is a In The Zone podcast brought to you by Game Time Sports. Live Carlos. from Central Station uh, Studios. Indeed. We got Chop, Colin, Naya. We signing out. Peace. Peace. My boy Colin, he like the coolest dude. He's like, I ain't got nothing. <laughs>